Welcome back to the Lucas Pope Power Hour Episode 4, the grand finale. I call this the grand finale because, uh, this is the game that Lucas Pope is working on right now. What? This is his brand new game he's working on. Right now? Right now. This is a demo. It's called... The Return of the Aubra Din. This is the GDC demo build. It's version 0.1.23. Uh, I think this was made in 2016, and he's hoping to have it released uh, at the end of this year, I think. Maybe next. Cool. But um, this is this is, is going to be a lot of fun. The volume here. Low speed, da, 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 da. So, so what exactly is this? Well, uh, I'll just let the game speak for itself. Let's okay. begin. Lost at sea in 1803. The good ship, the <laughs> Obra Din. The hint he gives is that Obra rhymes with Cobra. Built in 1796 in London, 800 tons, 18 feet draught, Captain R. Witterell, crew, 51 men, last voyage to Orient, Cape Rendezvous, unmet. Essentially, all the, the Oprah Din, well, well, we'll get there. Falmouth, England, 1807. Company man woke me up. Said you'd need ferry to the Oprah Din. The Obra Din, where Not all of the people mysteriously vanished. And we're gonna figure out why. Seems a bit late, if you ask. I didn't. <laughs> What's in the box? I don't know. A human head! Oh. I'll hoist it up in a few minutes. Hey! Ow! Carefully. Something special in this box, and I really like the style of this game. One bit rendering. Whoa! One bit of rendering. Wow. So here we are in the open ocean. Uh huh. There's our. Uh, Can you jump in the there? ocean? Uh, we, we cannot. This one we actually got to use WASD to move. Oh. Ooh. Oh, that's weird looking. So, uh, this game is a detective game, kind of. You know, it's a little bit of a walking simulator. Ooh. But, um, what if I told you it was a bit like Ghost Trick? What? <laughs> I'm down. I'm totally down. Okay. Uh, what can we possess first? <laughs> well, let's take a look around the Oberdin. Okay. It's a pretty large ship, I'd say. Uh, oh, so we managed to find it? It didn't, like, capsize or anything? Nope. Lu uh, Lucas Pope says that uh, the game won't exactly look like this, but because it's been improved a little bit since uh, yeah, then. I'm, I'm figuring, it's, yeah. But it's alright to extrapolate, you know, kind of game that it's going to end up being. Okay. I, I really like this. It takes my eyes a bit to get used to it, but, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm good. Set up here a bit first. like Ghost Trick. Now, when you around. say a bit like Ghost Trick, are you meaning in gameplay mechanics or just like the feel? Ah, uh, you'll see. All right. Ah, uh, you'll see. All right. All right. Well, when do we die? Take a look around here. I mean, it's a pretty neat looking ship, if you ask me. It does look pretty good. The graphics are incredible. I mean, one bit rendering, that's. Ooh. Oh, dear. Oh, that's something. Hmm. Da da. I get an uneasy feeling. Yeah, I'm getting pretty uneasy too, to be honest. God, see, a thieves looks great. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. It looks mm. like shit. Is he gonna hoist it up yet? Why is he not hoisting up my box? I don't know. Can we go in the? Can we go in the? Uh, let's check the doors yeah, here. Yeah, let's go oh. in the doors. Well, that's, nope, that that's locked. Not. What? Too heavy. Oh, too heavy. Oh, come on. You will oh. wimp and wh can go in here. Doesn't seem to be anything in here, though. Anything in the cabinets or anything oh. like that? What? Cabinet, no. Cabinet, no. Door, yes. There's two more doors over here. No, oh, no. Well. That. Just close, there. please. Thank you. Okay. Oh. So, this door is locked. And this door is. Oh, this, uh -huh. one, this one's open, though. Oh. Uh. All right, no, all right. No, oh, fine. Uh, fine. Okay, okay. Fine. Let's go back down over here. Where is that? Here it is. Yeah, there it is. Hmm. Yeah, too heavy. What are you fucking whip? It's too heavy. Take it yourself or open it again. Uh, so, no. Uh, no opening it. This is too heavy? Hmm. All right. Guess we'll just take it up ourselves then. A mysterious watch. Hmm. The memento mortem. Ooh. Remember death. Yes. Remember death. Yes. Oh, I think I know what you're talking about now. 
What do you think? Do we have to rewind time and see what happened? Go back a minute into the past? So, here is the gimmick of Return of the Obra <laughs> Let's go over to that corpse we found. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay. Remember how you died. Over here. And our little things popped up. And if we want to select this body, we just go ahead and click. And... Captain, oh, oh! So the captain just opens the door, opens fire on his own crew. Oh my God! Sheesh! Oh dear! So that's how that guy died. Yeah, you, can, you got limited time to look around a bit, and hey, he said a limited time. Where's this guy going? Ooh! Where's he going? So this isn't moving in slow motion, this is a freeze frame. It's freeze frame, you know, study about, you know, who's got what, where's where's who. <laughs> who who died where, and... Who's going on and all that, yeah, yeah. Bang. Bang, bang, so he killed him, we know that much. Okay, he killed him. Yes, that happened. Excellent. We can uh, click in to zoom in on their face if we want to see it a bit more. The facial rendering has been increased a little bit, I think, since then, if uh, the dev is a uh, devlog is to be believed. Yeah, you know, just uh, refining a little bit. It'd since. probably make it look better, yeah. This is an alpha demo, after all, and our time is running up, as you can see. And then... Well... And then we get shot, because we're in the way. No, we just... Back to the word of the living. Hmm. But, as a result... That door is now open. Ooh! Uh-huh. We can go ahead and look at his body any many times as we need to. We shall see why later. Come in here. We gotta find the crew... Muster roll book. It's probably somewhere. Here it is. This right here is uh, <laughs> everybody on the ship. This is for the for the good ship Oprah Din, departed into Formosa, but they never made it. We need to know two. And uh, pretty much what we got to do. Wow. These are all the people. We got the crewmates and we got the passengers. We got everybody here. And uh, I guess the goal of the game is to correctly predict and uh, figure out what the fates of all these guys were. For example, just... Oh, uh, God! Let's just say this Timothy Dalton guy uh, from Scotland. We'll just say that uh, his fate, he's, uh, he was killed by an enemy via hands. And we can write that down, but if you look back here, we can see that is wrong. Oh, how, how do you know that? Because it says fate's correct, and that's the zero. Oh, okay. So, it's not exactly a guessing game, but more of a giant puzzle game of figuring out how everybody died. You press tab to open up the crew monster roll. Figure out how some of these dudes died. So, so. now we need to figure out who is who. Exactly. Right? Oh. Right, way back here. What a great idea. Oh. That loops around. What a fun idea. Let's take a look at this guy now. Here we go! Dun dun! Been here someplace. I thought he was Batman there for a second. <laughs> <laughs> They're at the bottom of the sea. Uh oh. That's a lie. You're a lie. Ah! Oh dear. Oh, that's, that, that, that didn't go very well. Oh, he got his throat slit. Oh, oh no. Oh man. So that's not the captain, is it? This was after he got he shot that guy. Though. Oh, okay. So that guy didn't make it. Yeah, he definitely didn't make it. Uh, let's see. Uh, this guy definitely didn't make it. He got anything going on, shivved. Anything going on back here? Oh. Oh, this guy. Oh. oh, what are you doing here? Was he the guy that was going up the stairs? Uh-huh. So at the same time, uh, is that the captain? I don't believe so. I think. No, that was the other guy. Yeah. Okay, so the other guy that was next to Axeman when he died. So he slit his throat. We got another guy coming around here, but is there anybody in that room? Well, I can't. I can't open doors oh, okay. in this mode. They they show you just because enough. through these flashbacks. Oh, uh, head upstairs. Is how the door is open. If there's an open door in a flashback that opens no! a door in the real world. We're not going to get all the fates correct because you know there's obviously not all the people here, but uh, there's just a couple things I do want to do. Okay. 
So, uh, we'll move on. Specifically for this corpse. Move on to this guy now. God, that's cool. I know, right? So that guy gets a throw sleeve, falls to the ground, and dies. Ooh, stabbed in the back. Oh, no! We got bludgeoned right in the fucking head. Oh, so the guy who was coming around to hit him... So who's this guy, though? This isn't the captain. Oh, he did get stabbed. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Definitely stabbed. Got stabbed, but he managed to... But he got bludgeoned biff him. like crazy. <laughs> this is after okay, he Yeah, that guy is guy. dead. That guy's, that guy's still, still dead. Uh, wow. Are we able to go upstairs? Uh, I think so. Because I think that's the guy who went up and around. Yeah. Because he went up here... And he kind of jumped over there. Mm-hmm. Maybe there's stuff missing here. Maybe he's got a, a couple weapons that may or may not be here. Can you go down there? Ooh, look at that. But as a result, I'm pretty sure that this opens this door now. Ah. And there's there's a lady. There's somebody in here. It's a lady. Well, that's that's mysterious. And they're huh. dead too. Everybody's dead on this ship. Huh. Well, that door is open now as a result. Climb over the floor and all this shit. No. Mm. The body here and somewhere over there. We'll start with we'll start with this one. Donna. Abigail. Your brother. My friend. Killed me. I shot him. Uh-oh. I'll be with you soon, my love. Oh, so she already died. She died at sea. Please forgive me for everything. Oh! That's a suicide. That would be a suicide, and this is our captain. That's the captain? This is the captain. So he got stabbed by him and killed him. So the captain killed, like, three people before taking his own life. Looks like it. Sliced a guy's throat, bashed another guy's head in. Shot uh, this guy. Shot this head. guy in the head. Now, I only know the fates of three people right now. I don't know who this guy is or that guy, but I just know of three people. That would be the captain here, the guy he killed, and yeah, this lady. because that was his friend, right? Yeah. Her brother. Who was shot. Yes. Okay. He, the captain here... Yeah, so I know the captain, her brother, and this lady. That's the only three I know of right now, because there's no walkers in this game. Because it's something to experience yourself, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, right. So that's the excuse I'm going for anyway. Uh-huh, yeah. So, what we do is pull up the, pull up the thing here. Go over here, and Robert Witterell is the captain. It's pretty clear how he, suicide. How he did it. It's suicide by drowning. By drowning, by yes. Okay. And is that correct? It is correct. Very nice. So now he's talking about Abigail here. Let's see, where is Abigail? Aha. Uh-huh. Abigail Horst Witterell. Witterell. Uh-huh. So Abigail died somehow, but shouldn't we look at the other Witterell and assume his death? William Hoshed. William Hoshed? Yep, William Hoshed, because Abigail Hoshed. Oh, a hyphenated name. Yes. So, so Hoshed died he by gunshot. He was killed by a I... crewmate... The uh, crewmate of Wobber Rural via the uh, gun. He shot him. Shot him. Is that correct? It yeah. is. Yeah. It's all right. Uh, now we know that. Let's see what happened to Abigail. I wonder what kind of terrible fate uh, befell upon her. Mm-hmm. So fun. Okay. Yes. What? What? Whoa! Oh! Whoa. Oh my goodness! Oh, dude! The Kraken's here. Oh! <laughs> He's fucking everything. Oh, something definitely happened on this ship. Absolutely. Oh, oh she got blasted oh, in the man. face with the- Oh, man. Oh, I don't know who this fellow is. Oh, dear. There's the captain. Yeah. 
his captain was fighting there. the Kraken. Yep. Oh, man. That's a bad wave there, buddy. Oh, man. Who are those people? Who are these two? Uh, kind of creepy faces, I gotta say. A lot of questions left unanswered. That guy's not gonna do very well. Oh, man. So clearly, this is the mystery we have to solve aboard the Oprah Din, because it was more than just a simple mutiny or a, a argument on terms of payment or anything like that. Yeah. No, this is, this is not good. No way. Not at all. A Kraken attack. Huh. Huh, huh. So we'll just open up our book here and go over to... Uh, Death by Kraken. To Abigail. <laughs> or Skull Kraken. She was killed by a beast's tentacles tentacles is that right that's not right it's not right hmm so maybe it's uh destruction then because it wasn't the tentacles that killed him it was there we yeah, go yeah okay so that's three out of three i know I'm not sure everybody else is this might be a scottish guy if that's the case and whoops that's the case. Damn. He was killed uh, by. <laughs> See, I'm thinking he was killed by the gun, maybe. I mean, because he was shot, but gun. How... But, th but that wasn't right. You already got the guy with the gun. He was killed, but uh, I, 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 I just don't know. I don't know who anybody else is. That's the only three I know of. Everything else is left to chance. I'm pretty sure that the game will be, you know, much more. Uh, Oh, how, how far does this go? I meant to ask you. This is about as far as it goes. Oh, okay. This is this is it, unfortunately. Well, cool. But uh, what about the other door? Well, I can't open the door. No, no, no. I mean the. Oh, oh, wait. That would have been the door the women were peering out of, right? Yes. Okay. So uh, maybe that door was open. Nope. Nope. That's just the other way out, though. Okay. So yeah, that was Return of the Obra Dinn. Is there any way we can go down here? I haven't been down here yet. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck. Thanks for playing. <laughs> okay, I'm down. So yeah, that was Return of the Oprah Din. Uh, I'm I, gu I guarantee when this comes out, you can expect an LP on this because this shit looks amazing. It was fucking awesome. I'm all over this shit, Lucas Pope. I love your stuff, man. I love your work. Love what you do. Can't wait to play it. Unless it sucks, then. Even if it sucks, I'll play it because yeah, you know, with, play. The, with this much ingenuity behind it, how can it be bad? How can it be bad? Man, nah. how exciting. Hope you enjoyed the Lucas Pope Power Hour, and uh, we'll see you next week with something brand new. Let's set sail for something new. Yes. What do you say, matey? Sounds great. That's well, not that's not a hint or anything. I just wanted to pull out the no, pirate no, voice. No, no, no. Just be a pirate. See you next time. Yar, har, fiddle-dee-dee. Being a pirate at Hawaii with me.